Storm Kieran has been named by the Met Office. This is a low pressure system that is going to move across the UK throughout Wednesday night and through Thursday. And let's have a look at the detail on the pressure pattern to do with this. So this is what we've got to start as we go into the new week. Low pressure is going to be around throughout the week, bringing various weather fronts across the UK throughout Monday and Tuesday. But we start to notice as isobars become more tightly packed together as we go into the start of Wednesday and that is ahead of Storm Kieran moving into the southwest on Wednesday night sweeping northeastwards throughout the day on Thursday and you can see by the time we get to the middle part of Thursday how tightly packed together those isobars are especially through the English Channel so that means some very strong winds expected here. Now let's have a look at the details. So the rain is going to start to arrive in the southwest Wednesday evening, pushing northeastwards as we go into the early hours of Thursday. And that's going to bring some pretty heavy bursts of rain persistent in places. Now the rain warning is only out for the south of England and Wales at the moment, but there will be rain further north as well. Winds strengthening too throughout the night on Wednesday, peaking through the day on Thursday. So let's have a look at the detail in those warnings. So firstly, looking at that yellow rain warning, starts at 6pm on Wednesday and goes throughout the day on Thursday, covering southern parts of Wales and southern parts of England. Now the totals that we're looking to see in these areas will bring some disruption, especially to transport. So do bear that in mind if you have a journey planned for Wednesday night or during Thursday. Now moving on to have a look at that yellow wind warning. Now this starts at midnight on Thursday and currently goes through to 6 p.m. on Thursday, covering a very similar area to that rain warning, but extending up into East Anglia as well. We're looking to see 50 to 60 mile per hour gusts in land and potentially up to 90 mile per hour gusts for some exposed coasts, most likely through the English Channel. Now these are just the two warnings that we have at the moment. They are are likely to be updated with further warnings expected. So to keep up to date with all of that, check out our app and our website and make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you never miss an update on Storm Kieran.